I'm Erica Naone, I'm an editor for Technology Review, and today I'm here to demonstrate the Siftio blocks. Siftio blocks started as a research project at the MIT Media Lab at the time they were called Siftables. And these blocks are a computerized interface that can communicate, they can communicate between themselves and you can move them around and manipulate them with your hands. So the people who created it at the Media Lab have now made this into a product and they're going to be marketing it initially for games, but there are other possible uses for the blocks as well. And so I'll show you a little bit about how they work. Siftio blocks, they come in sets of three initially, um, but there's the possibility to expand, so people might want six. The number of blocks determines how much you can do with them. There are ideal numbers for different types of applications. Um, so this is a charging device that holds the blocks. Um, to make them work, you have to have the SIFT runner program running on your computer, and you plug in this device, um, which connects through USB and sends a signal to the blocks to control them and run programs. Um, the blocks respond to different types of movement. They recognize when they're being flipped over, they recognize when they're being tilted, they recognize when they're being touched to each other, um, and they can also recognize their orientation, so you can put them up on their side. Uh, I'll start by just showing an example of a game that was designed by one of Siftio's engineers. I'm going to turn on the music now. This is called Chroma Shuffle, and it's a pretty traditional kind of game. You need to line up colored blocks. But what's different is the way that the blocks interact with each other. So to make a selection, I put two blocks together so the arrows line up. And then to play the game, I match up colors across different blocks. And I can change the orientation of things on the screen by tilting them. So for example, flipping the block slides around the, the color. This game also includes a provision for refilling blocks by flipping them over. So it's a pretty classic game that people would recognize, but the tactile interaction changes how it feels to play it. Siftio has a bunch of programs that they've made themselves that they'll be launching along with the blocks. You can buy them in an app store, much like what's used for the iPhone today. They also have a software development kit that allows third parties to create apps for the blocks.